Welcome back everybody to Farming Simulator 19 here on Ravenport 19. Why am I staring at the door? Folks, it's your host, Mr. Blue, aka Tommy Miller. Folks, uh, okay, I, I've been living in a shack, okay? I, I, I'm, I'm sorry, uh, I just don't have a house. So I've been living here. But anyway, I gotta definitely watch my step. But anyway, we we gotta get something to mow our horse pen with. I ain't seen nobody do that yet on YouTube. Actually, mow the inside of the pen. Um, lots of things going on today. First of all, let's check on our animals. Our sheep's doing pretty good. Doing pretty good. Hundred percent productivity uh, on both of them. I'm going to need some food here before long. Probably some water in the next couple days. Or chickens. I just got through cleaning them earlier this morning. And uh, I thought I was going to pause it. I'm like, well, I'll just start the video out this way. So, uh, but look at that. Our 30 minutes, we get another uh, uh, chicken. Uh, one of the other YouTubers is saying... You know, you know, like up here, or it was, it was with the cows. I don't have the cows, but it's like if you buy four of these, four of those, and four of these, and four of those. I guess if you buy them all at the same time, is the only way I can consider it working. Is you'll get so you got four groups, so a group of white, group of brown, group of black, group of pink, or whatever. Uh, you'll get a uh, animal for each group if you have it at the same time. So the white and brown, uh, you see the time is different. So you'll get animal for that and, and an animal for that. And so that's going to be pretty good. So the more groups you got, the more you'll get, seems like. Uh, our horses are up to 37,000 now, um, 74% done on their training and stuff and getting them lean and fit and all that they're going to need some hay which ain't no problem with that and some straw still ain't no problem with that um i'm gonna put up more more uh chickens and more uh horses uh pastures and stuff that's it one more thing i want to show y'all uh, actually, I want to check. Uh, we had some great demands. Well, fast forward time, but I think they're over with now. Yeah, it looks like they're over with. Uh, I want to check on wolves at $900, but eggs. Look at that price right there, folks. And that's down price. We got to get some pallets for them, though. Uh, as far as soybeans, they're all going, well, this one's going down anyway. Uh, we got wheat, oats, and soybeans, if i uh, not mistaken. Let's go back here. It has wheat, oats, and soybeans. We got three fields plus the combined. So that's pretty good. We are going to uh, start our harvest today because it is ready. But first, first, folks, by the way, I hope y'all are doing okay. We're going to get in our little, oh, it's not little. We're getting our, our whoa our Dodge pickup here if I can get into it. This truck just ain't running right. It is just not running right. Um, the brakes on it, it's like it's locking. See, I'm going and it's hard to pick up speed. But folks, check us out. I finally got it. I got course play. Now this is a very, very early beta. Uh, they do say that it's got all kind of bug defects and it could actually blow up your computer. I don't know about going that far, but you know they do warn you that things could happen. As you can see, farm one to market, and uh, also on market I done got. Uh, market to farm, uh, market to field 11, and market to farm. 
Um, so three courses generated so far. But is this like 17? Um, only thing I really haven't checked out is the combine helper, which I don't got that added. But um, we're gonna drive course. And we're gonna stop at the last point. Always make sure you check this in folks. If not, it's going to keep driving past the point. It'll be slow, but it will drive past the point. Oh, you're going through my grass. But sure, grass is ready. The grass grows fast on this map. All right, you should turn. Yeah, you kind of overshot it right there. But uh, let's go ahead and hop on around here. Um... This guy was up by yeah, 12 when we fertilizing. Um, we should have a lot more harvest fields coming off here, but uh, you know, turn around here, which it might take them a few minutes to get down here. But so far, course play has been doing pretty good, folks. Let's see, these are soybeans, so not going to worry about, well, can't worry about straw. Um, I've been downloading a lot of mods, uh, so we got a lot of things to go for. It's just, uh, let's see if I can swing around here and get a picture. Raise that header up for a minute. There's our truck coming, top right. You can see it. Now I do have the uh, speed where, you know, it's not very fast, probably about 25 mile an hour on the course play port. But we are going to go ahead and start the harvest. You can, you can see our dually coming right there. He's going to go to the market. We're going to probably trade that truck in and uh, get us another one. Which is another ram, I believe. Yeah, I got the course play route. Maybe a little too slow, but it's okay. Well, we are going to try to sell these beans. We're probably going to put them in storage for a little bit. I know y'all hate hear me say that, but hey, we stockpile them. And then sell them when we got a great demand. Folks, we are going to be in hog heaven with money. Which, everything's going to break loose here pretty soon. Probably not the next couple episodes, but I say within the next five to ten episodes, it should break loose because our horses are getting ready to sell. Um, when we sell them, I'm going to buy, buy, buy back eight new horses to fill our pen back up. But I'm going to also turn around and use that money to probably put down a new horse pad. And this time it's going to be a little bit bigger. It's going to be bigger, folks. See, I'm going to... I need to turn, 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 turn. There we go. Don't hit the water tire. Oh, yeah. Cleared it by a mile. Tell you I'm going to clear. Oh, yeah. Am I going to make it? Oh, yeah. I actually did swing pretty good. I need to turn my wheels back up. I slowed them down because I'm like, you know, this is just way too fast. But it seems like it's going to work pretty good. But uh, if y'all go down below, down in the description box there, folks, you're going to see uh, some of uh, my all-time favorite YouTubers. And there's a lot that I haven't listed yet. Go down there and check out Peanut. Oh, no, my phone's dying. I'm charging my Bluetooth. But anyway, go down and check out Peanut. He plays Farmer Simulator also and Farmer's Dynasty. And uh, I think it's House Flipper. Uh, it's where you buy houses and you, you uh, clean them up, paint them and all that. And turn around and resell them. Pretty nice game. 
but uh, let's see. I hired a worker, and sure enough, right quick, bring this back up and go over here and hit that, and voila. Now, what I noticed so far is it's slow. They're probably going to have to do something, make it run a little bit faster. Okay, we're going to stop driver. I wish that was different. But close this out. Now, the reason why I got it stopped right here, and it, you can tell it's laggy at first, but I'm willing to work through that, you know, because I, I love course play. But anyway, I, I had it to stop right there because I got it fixed where we can come in from the farm and select another course, you know, like market to fill 11. We can go from farm one to market and then select another course at the same time we're selecting, you know, farm to market. Say we want to go to field 11 from the farm. What I do, I would... Yeah, oh, wrong one. Open this up. Um, go to here. We go from farm one to market. We'll add that. And then we go market to fill 11. Do that, and it'll say two combined courses. Well, when it goes from farm to market, it'll cancel that now and then go from market to fill 11. Or vice versa. If I just want to bring it down here, uh, but I would have to watch it if I do that. You know, uh, farm to market, then market to farm. It'd be just riding around, you know, not doing nothing. But anyway. Let's sell this thing. I can hop out. There we go. And I do see some small, minor things with course play. Uh, but just remember, it's very early beta. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and repair and $16. I ain't going to get that much more. 54000 out of it. So we're going to sell it. Yes. Might be walking home. Okay, yeah, we're gonna go in here. Um, where's that? Oh, way over here under cars. There's supposed to be a new one. Um, all these, uh, I'm using this on Michigan map, and when y'all see this, y'all probably already know it's out, but um. I don't know. See, it's got the same picture there and there. I just wonder. I I, I like to try this one, but uh, sixty-seven thousand ain't quite there. And this is the fifteen hundred uh, Rebel, the thirty thousand, just a regular pickup. I think it's got a fuel tank in the back. And see, we got the F three fifty Platinum. Which is here. Let's see what it looks like. Yeah, it says it's a dually. Ooh, I love that sunroof. Uh, design. Oh, it's. It's got the. Uh, this in here will do the. Uh, uh, it's like a three point hitch on the front. And decal on the side there, no decal, uh, fuel tank, all accessories there. So that's that. 67. I already used this, and I'm trying to slide this thing. It's not, don't do that way. So, um, think about this one or this one. Let's look at this one here. Mm, it is this in here just looks so much sweeter it is a ram uh, let's go color first um, nitro blue hmm, not bad uh, let's see here New Holland that's the one I usually do it's that darker color 
design. What's the design? Let's make it yellow so it stand. Oh no, it's inside. Um, what was the original color? Tan. Let's. I'm gonna go with black. Man, just something about black. Engine setup. We're gonna get the max 5.7 Hemi. That's still 37,000. Wheel setup. Aluminum. Uh, I guess that's all on my setup. Let's just zoom in here. So I think as far as we zoom in, really? I need some spotlights on these things, people. I like those. Those kind of like what's on my Chevy right now. Uh, attachers. Gooseneck hitch. Standard. Oh, we're going to go with the gooseneck hitch. Oh, it's that kind. Okay. Uh, design. Let's see what the design does. Go this way. Toolbox. Really? That's it? Hmm. I do like it. I, I really do like it. Um. I, I know I'm. I, I shouldn't do this, folks. Uh, let's go to this and look at it. We'll be kind of fast. I feel load. No, we might get both. This might be our work truck. Oh, it's got the light bar on top. Wait, is that a dually? I don't want to do the. I guess I'm gonna. Yeah. It is a dually, and this has a. Um. Did my game just raise? <laughs> okay, my game just freeze froze. I get out. Yeah, that might be my problem right there. All right, folks, I'm, I'll be back in a little bit. I got to figure out what's going on here. I didn't push a button that time. All right, be right back. All right, folks, I'm back. And once again, apologize for that. That did crash my computer with that mod, so... I'm going to have to take that out. Um, can y'all guess which one I did go with? Uh, yeah, that's right. There was only one left. I went with the uh, Rebel truck. Uh, combine's got 60% in it, so I'm taking this tractor and buggy on down here. So uh, you can see a little bit of us harvesting. Um... I actually thought it would be full by now, but I did not. Well, I said it crashed computer, didn't I? I did not restart the computer. I hit Windows button, and uh, it took me back to you know my home screen, my desktop screen, and uh, of course I still had OBS running. And I noticed that when I went to. Alright, I'll be right back. Alrighty, folks, I'm down here. I done tried to record this twice and uh, had some interruptions. But anyway, where was I? Oh, yeah. Uh, the PC did not crash, but it did freeze the game. I went back to my Windows mode and. Uh, when I did that, I had OBS open and uh, wasn't recording, but I just had the screen open. And, uh, hey, come back here. Yeah, I got going back to the uh, shop. Did I hit stop at the last point? Yeah, that was active. But uh, anyway, let's check out the inside while we're let's driving. Get rid of this box here real quick. Uh, yeah, I feel like uh, y'all ever see that movie Night Rider? 
where the wheels are just turning it itself. <laughs> I, I love the detail they done. And I would wish my truck had a sunroof like that. I wish it just had one in general, you know, period. Um, yeah, we're going to go right down here. But I figured I'd go with this and, you know, it's cheaper. It'll still pull the gooseneck. I might not be able to pull that much. I got the toolbox in there. It's kind of like my personal farm truck. I wish I could take the uh, strobe lights off the other truck and put on this one. Alright, this is where uh, Market to Farm brings me to, and he should stop right here. And, oh, wrong button. Oh, come on. Okay, I gotta hop out, hop back in. Helper A. Uh, I wish I had my names. But anyway, stop driver. We'll close that out. Get rid of that. We're also going to get rid of that. But it's so quiet. It's super duper quiet. Okay, um. I also got another seed runner I need to install. Uh, download it, but I think I forgot to install it. Uh, it's a little bit different, so hopefully that will work. But you can see, I got uh, a lot of stuff over there put away, and a uh, weeder over there put away. Of course, we're fixing to start using them. Oh, don't hit the pole, don't hit the pole. This is gonna pull up in here. Man, let's go check on our other stuff. I'm waiting on him to turn around. I should have done the ends on this. First, give them some room to turn. And, and you saw what the truck was sitting at. Let's go ahead and oh, let's take this off. And then, yeah, he's going to go straight on out. I'm going to back up and get this little spot right here. But, uh,. Um, yeah, I, I like course play. Well, I love course play. You know, what little I have been playing of it, mainly just transports, but it seems like it's going to be a okay so far. Um, yeah, come on, stop. When we go to mow that field. I'm going to do it a little bit different. You can make a uh, outline of the field with the mower. And then add it. Somehow or another, you either add it to the beginning or the end. And then you do a uh, field trajectory or whatever it's called. Oh, come on. There we go. And uh, it will create the field line and stuff for you so uh you can mow that so what i want to do is go out a little extra uh, all those places where i don't want them up there's actually two different ways you can do it you can just do the whole field or you, you can just do the outline like i was talking about i hope this oh yeah plenty of room And I'm trying to Oh come on now. Trying to get my speed set right. Oh it's still going in. There we go. A little too fast probably. There we go. Yeah, something got to be about right there in order to work right. Which I think I can fix that. I can go into that because this is the outer um, 
it's a mod so any any mod you got you can go in and edit and stuff so I'm um, thinking about going in and editing this because I kind of I kind of like this there's bigger ones but I don't think we can go to a bigger one than this because of the uh, combine let's see right there it's not going in it just And of course it's empty. <laughs> That's one reason why it might not be going in. My bad. But I see right now it's, it's just going to take time to harvest this. Oh my God. My patience here lately, folks, has just been unreal. Uh, I put the semi-truck here for now. When we get some of that cub, I might move over in the field. But uh, that's the only place I really had. Um, oh yeah, I gotta show you another spot, but I have to have our gator to get to it. So let's turn our little beacon lights on so the bear run over us. Yeehaw, this thing moves too, by the way. Um, yeah, I did get some pallets down here for our eggs, because we got three boxes now, as you can see right there. Uh, the gooseneck trailer right there, we're going to turn in and get a better one. Or, supposed to be better anyway. And y'all probably like, uh, where all the trees go, Mr. Blue? Folks, I've been busy on trees. Ones you see up there, I cannot get to. It's, uh, past the collision on the map. Um, got 148,000 liters of wood chips here. 48 there and 100,000 there. And, you know, I was talking about raising this right here up so this field be even. Because there's a big drop here. Well, yeah. I didn't know it was actually this deep, but. You can probably see right here. You're going to be like, oh, my God, what happened here? Uh, well, construction crew came in and uh, flattened it all out. It was flat they can get it and. uh I'm already put grass back down to grow. But I got lots of money up here laying on the ground. Uh, probably not a load right there, but over here in the trailer, you can see it's loaded. Uh, just need a truck to haul it. Um, it. It don't look as bad as I thought it's going to look, but we got room here for a couple of chicken coops down through here probably I wish my camera would go out a little bit further but through here I'm thinking about putting a, a horse stable it's a little bit different than the rest of them uh, this hill here I had it all flattened too but I couldn't and you see the mushrooms above this might be an issue but I'm trying to overlook them but on your left side of your screen, you can see like a grassy mound with a hole in it, like a cave. Well, that's what this was when I flattened all this. That was a big old, big old gaping hole right here. So I tried to fill it back in. And folks, when you're on the edge of a map, it is very, very rough. Oh, oh. I'm gonna get stuck there. I hey, my phone in the middle. Uh, sorry, folks, I had to check out and take message, but it was just uh, some, somebody else. I was making sure it wasn't a fire text or something. But yeah, uh, these rocks right here, you can't do nothing with them. They're just gonna stay there. But those trees there, all them out of them out of the pack there. If I get down without flipping. Oh, don't flip, don't flip, don't flip. Oh. Oh, come on. Okay. I I'm glad I can have this mod right here. Uh, lift. Uh oh. Lift anything heavy. I figured out how to rotate. I just got to remember which direction switch. 
Yeah. Blue. Bow, 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 bow. But anyway, yeah, and that kind of made that look a little bit better, but I'm just going to stay away from it, not look at it. Uh, got a little house right there on top. I wish I could take it away, but yeah, right in this area here, I'm going to put that horse stable. And hopefully, between the wood chips and the logs I got, I got some pretty good sized ones here. Uh, might have enough to go ahead and get another horse. The horse uh, lot this itself, you know. Um, let's go in here real quick and go over to placeables. Yeah, prob oh, up here, animals. I want to show y'all this one. Is this one right here? 95,000. No, it's not going to let me. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. Um, this is a cow shed, I believe. And you got autumn oaks, cow pasture. But this in here, it'll. 16. It'll hold 16 horses. And, and it looks pretty good. They walking in and out the building and stuff. Um, here's a paddock, okay. Uh, this in here holds 16 also, but they don't have no shade, folks. It's all out in the open. So, I thought, you know, this is one we got now. This one holds 16. So, and there's the other two cow pastures, uh, 200. And there's 50 large chicken coop is 400, and that's what we got here. So, plenty of room there. Well, I thought about putting down these here, a whole 100 each. Oh, what? what? Oh, I only got 16,000. Uh, I ain't thought about the dog yet. Uh, if I find a house or something. I'll go from there. I guess I could live in here. What, what is this? Oh, it's like a water pump station or something. We got a water pump there on the side. But ain't no telling. It ain't no telling, folks. Uh, what are you doing? If, uh... Huh. Can you get on my crops? So I can fire you, because if I fire you right now, then we'll have crop destruction. What is he doing? Surely he didn't back all the way up there. Is it wide enough to the whole thing? It looks like it. Alright, well, I'm going to fire you for a second, whoever you are. Um, oh, yeah, the sense of the horses is the, is the only thing I can um, sign names to. I said this in earlier episodes that I'm going to use the horses to uh, what's a good word for it? Promote? I don't, I don't think promote. Uh, uh, we give thanks to maybe? Uh, you know I'll go in name it like Couple Up, Bama Girl Amy, uh, Bo, Pit Dog, or Pit Bull Gaming. Sorry about that. Um, Peanut, you know just I'll name them that way to give uh, thanks in, for the support that they have given me and uh, that way you're like, oh, huh, couple of mm, okay, oh, bad my girl, Amy. hey, yeah, don't bad my girl, Amy don't watch her chat, you know, that way it's just like, you know y'all can kind of show off my YouTubers, ones that com comments the most uh, there's a lot, there's a couple of them there, uh, 
I gotta scoot over probably. And I think it was about right there. That should work. 34%, so that ain't too bad. I don't know how many liters then are. 8,729 and that 30,000 right there almost 3,600 so almost roughly 12,000 liters right now now let's see what this what the uh, fields need I limed it and plowed it and um, all that good stuff, so it shouldn't need nothing. Oh, that just looks funny when it takes away like that. But yeah, the um, only other field that I don't own is this section right here. I would actually like to buy this section. Because um, from right in this area here, I could make another field. Um, let's go look at that real quick if we can. Um, I'm thinking about buying, I don't know how much they are, but uh, Dagrin, I believe, had them on his channel. They're a 70 series tractor, uh, kind of like our other one. They're a little bit smaller, they're smaller than this one, but they will uh, should have the horsepower I'm trying to think what's close by there are little big blinky lights on we have uh, we do have uh, flashers but they are uh, flashing so fast they don't really have any detail to them I don't remember this being this deep but I didn't make it deeper, I just uh, flattened it all the way out and across. Which, uh, when we get this field harvest, all that's going to be even across here. And, uh, and we might have different roads too. But uh, between it and course play, we're uh, going to be doing pretty good. Let's see, I think that's it right there right across from our horses come on little putt putt you see how it's pretty open there yeah goes from about right there over to there and then you can go up and around the edge there we can plow all that but I don't know if it's going to be worth go back to lands $386,000 oh wait wrong one <laughs> $346,000 there's quite a bit more trees we got there uh, might be worth it in a tree value but I don't know let's go empty out the combine uh, surely he's not coming back down here Oh, got in, in. oh, he's got one little spot right there he's getting. Okay. Well, I'm like, wow, he's actually going to... Actually going to do it there. Let's uh, go ahead and catch him. You didn't get all of it, mister. Well, why that's still showing the Hemi up there. Probably because the last one I was in and left the motor running. Alright, we got... Oop. I'm gonna miss... Nope, got it. I really need to put some irons on this combine. It's only... Uh, uh, what is it? 4.3 irons? And I'm still pretty... I'm about halfway, so... Huh. Be right back, folks. All right, I 
I'm back, folks. I am so terribly sorry about that. Um, <laughs> that there it was a, just a very, very rude phone call. I, I hate it when they call and just don't say nothing. They're, they'll make sure you can hear them breathing, but that'd be all they do. But anyway, um, y'all probably like, well, why don't you pause or, or mute that or put it on vibrate or something while you record? Well, folks, I'm a firefighter slash first responder um, slash whatever they need me for. Um, been doing it since late part of 2004 until now and, and plan on doing it as long as I can. But anyway, the uh, thing is we got oh my god, we got weeds growing. Oh god, they can, they can wait. But right now, you know, with my back situation, I, I don't work. I'm, I'm trying to get my disability. Uh, but what's really kicking it is because I'm helping with the fire department. Uh, it, it's rough because, you know, there's a lot of things I can't do as far as lifting. Uh, and ee, kissing the tail end of a combine. Um, lifting standing for a long time and some bending over uh, you know not all days but certain days it will definitely let me know oh come on oh I'm on I forgot I turned my speed up Trying to watch a combine out here hit and get my speed too. That should do. Yeah, I got got it to get that fixed. But actually, I want to buy a bigger grain cart. But if I do that, I think I have to buy a bigger combine. But anyway, back to my little situation here. I'm the only one on call right now on the fire department. Uh, which everybody's on call, you know, we all got our phones and pagers and stuff, but what I'm saying is everybody else is at work. We got factory workers, we got farmers, um, just different kind of workers, you know, here and there, but uh, let's see where, he is empty, okay. See, it's empty now, way up there. That needs to be switched. But anyway, as I was saying, uh, right now, during the day, I'm the only one that's uh, available, and I try to record and do both, you know. Sicker sheeps out real quick. But yeah. I, I, that's why I try to keep the phone uh, loud so I can hear what's going on. Ooh, ooh, almost two pallets. We, we definitely need to get some more sheeps in here. I got to get an animal trailer so we won't have those fees. Trying to think what I need to do now besides uh, harvesting, you know, because uh, I got... Uh, Got a couple up on the uh, combine, and um, I could do course play where we can put Kyle and Julian on the uh, grain buggy, and he can self unload the combine. Now that would be neat. Got to run over here and uh, get our gooseneck. I want to see if it'll fit on this truck. I know we probably don't have enough money to change it out. So I probably won't worry about that. Um, Alright, can't let the tailgate down. 
So this gonna get a little weird, folks. A little weird. Invisible tailgate. Well, not invisible. Collision-free tailgate. There we go. Um. Okay. Okay. This truck might not be for us. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Well, horse battery. What's going on here? It's not hitting the bed of the truck. But I got my wheels turned and Yeah, it's like the trailer's in the ground. When I do that, it goes forward. Maybe it's because I got hooked up in a in a angle. Try to get straightened up here. And yeah, see, combine's got fourteen percent in it, so I'm still good to go there. But I need to watch it a little bit. Ah, oh, it just picks me up and slams me over. Okay, okay, we uh. Taking this trip back. We got a default truck. I actually think about getting the one that crashes the game. Yeah. And let's see. The chickens. I cleaned them. And I really don't know where they're at on uh, that wrong one. Animals. Chickens. 99 percent oh yeah their their food i have not fed them folks but i think they lost seven liters uh, as this oh yeah but uh let's see where's our combine at yeah i might do the ends right there it's getting pretty rough but anyway folks i don't really quite know how much time i got i know it was 18 the first time and i got interrupted several times oh me uh, i really 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 don't know what to do six mile an hour we're going to you have to get another combine or get a bigger combine. I think that's our next thing we need to worry about. Um, so we're going to sell the soybeans when we get them harvested with the best price. It's, it's, I, I know the price is probably going down or to its low. Yeah. Let's see. 13, 13. Uh, Central Grain Elevator at sixteen hundred right now. Oops. Yeah, one thousand six hundred three dollars for every thousand liters. So take this price. I don't know how that works really. Take that price and times it by that. Eh, I don't know. My mind ain't thinking, folks. Well, I do want to, uh, uh, yep, there's the weeds. It hasn't got these yet, so probably when I harvest, we'll have weeds come in behind. Um, I, like I said, I like to get a bigger combine, but then again, I like to get one of these fields right in this central location here and build another shop. I actually think about taking field nine because it's a grass field and we'll get a lot of missions on that. Uh, well, same mission. But uh, 10, 11, of course, 8 is, oh, we make money off of 8. 6, 12, 13, 10, 11, 8, and 7 in this area. And of course, these little guys here, they, they give us some money, but when we start going up, up in here we do get money off of these but not very that solemn five is usually fertilized missions 
four gives us trouble every now and then. But I thought about right here on field three of buying it. We had to buy this too. So 448 and my wife say three. So about almost seven to eight hundred, seven to eight hundred K for both of these together. But I don't know. I just, I like hat. I'm thinking this here is 770,000. We can use a bio plant gas, you know, bring grass, put it here. We can also do, uh, put a sh little shed here or something and use this area here. It looks like a pretty good size lot right in here but that's probably where the silo bunkers are at well we just need a, a central location that way we can cover these fields up here i don't know we'll, we'll figure something out i'm gonna do uh an end around on the ends i should say and um I guess I need to bring this 7R down and take the fertilized thing off of it. Take those wood chips and sell them. We'll probably do that in the next mission. So I'm going to get off here, folks, because I really don't know how long this video is. And uh, I'm going to do some of this bean thrashing off screen. Uh, probably go get the uh, 7R, bring it down. And uh, take the wood chips up there so y'all can see that sale on the uh, next episode and uh, try to see where to go from there. I'm not worried about the weeds till we get done harvesting. I would like to put something in behind the combine so we can get our stuff, you know, get everything rocking and rolling. Well, folks, until next time. Oh, he's just so slow. That's the only thing about performing simulator. The hired help is just slow, slow about turning around. Hmm. Anyway, y'all have a great day, folks. A blessed day. And I will see y'all later. Bye.